Acker's 102 for as well. A great win for the team on a record-breaking day. How good does that one feel? Yeah, obviously a great day for the boys today. Um, sets up phenomenally well by, by Rishi and, and Sol up top. You know, I think they've been phen phenomenal for us so far this season. You know, laying that foundation and allowing our batters to come in and play with freedom. Um, obviously they did that at Surrey and as well at uh, Beckenham against Kent and, and today as well. So, you know, long, long may that continue. And talking of Rishi, the way he's played in all three formats this season, just speaking to him there about becoming the first ever Leicestershire player to hit a century in all formats in the same season. How impressed have you been with him this time? Yeah, Rich has been fantastic this season for us. Um, the, the thing that's impressed me the most is his hunger for runs. You know, he's not happy with a 60 or 70. Um, you know, he's looking to go big and, and like he did today. You know, he batted deep into the innings um, and laid that foundation extremely well for us today. And as did you, bringing up another list day century for the club. Uh, what was the key to scoring on, on that wicket, especially, you know, with, with one short side? Yeah, I suppose we lost a couple of wickets when I came in, so we kind of had to rebuild a bit. Um, we know that we got Bian Milder and, and Louis Kimmer to come in um, after me, so you know I had to kind of take my time a bit um, and just knock it around a bit um, and give ourselves a bit more of a platform to launch towards the back end. You know, Vian's obviously showed this season so far that he's capable of striking at 130, 140, um, you know, straight off the bat. So um, as well as Louis Kimmer, so. I just had to take it a bit deep today um, and lucky it, it paid off towards the back end. And when we came to bowl, obviously Lancashire got a very good top four and James and Villas were going really well at one stage. What was the, the key to bowl on this wicket, do you think? Yeah, I suppose today we had to just stay as calm as possible. Um, we knew that it was a good wicket and it was good to bat in the power play up front. So we just had to you know, stick to our basics for as long as possible. We knew that they had to keep coming hard uh, with a big you know, total on the board. So. We knew that a couple of wickets would, would change the game. Um, obviously, Keaton Jennings batted pretty well to get 120, um, you know, so he kind of set, set the tone for then. But you know, our middle overs are pretty good. I think we controlled the, the scoring rate pretty well. Um, it was a good wicket, so you just had to accept that you, know, you would go for boundary every now and again, but you just had to focus on the next ball. And talking of that scoreboard pressure, do you think that's what, what led to those two run outs that the, you know, they need to put quick runs on the board and it ultimately led to their downfall? Yeah, without a, without a doubt, I think. Um, Obviously, scoreboard pressure is, is a big thing. Um, they knew that they had to stick with the rate, and when you bowl a few dots, they, they sometimes make a few decisions. You know, um, that obviously went our way today. So, I think I thought we were pretty good in the field today, taking a few good catches, and obviously two run two run outs changed the game for us. Seems sort of been the key for us so far in the first three games, with the likes of Hulley, Scriv, and Roman all picking up sort of fourfers and fifers. Spin really came into the game today. How well do you think that you bowl personally and Utam as well on debut? Yeah, I think we've involved extremely well. Um, you got three wickets today on on this day, David, which is which is fantastic. I suppose it's just about assessing conditions. Obviously, against Notts, it was a seam-friendly pitch, so you know our seamers did the damage there. Um, and today, it was more of a spinner's wicket, so you just got to assess conditions as quickly as possible. It's now three wins uh, in a row on the road. A short trip, uh, well, a long trip to Hampshire, but a short turnaround in that time for Sunday. How you know important is that confidence and momentum to build in these early stages of the comp? Yeah, I think you know everybody's done extremely well so far this campaign. Everybody's chipped in here or there, so the confidence is is definitely up in the group at the moment. Um, we'll enjoy tonight's win and, and travel down to Southampton tomorrow, reassess, and then you know obviously try to put on a big performance against Hampshire on Sunday.